Meanwhile, uh, you have the uh, Prince, Prince Charles and his haggling uh, Camilla Bowles or whatever her name is, Camilla Parker Bowles. Uh, there are people rampaging all over London about having their tuitions tripled. Oh, but the taxes are all going up. But see, everything goes to the bankers. See, they don't need you anymore. They grew their government. They got you addicted to it. Their police state and telescreens and face scanners are in place. They don't need you. So the, 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 the people are running around, and, and, and they threw some bags of paint on the car reportedly and yelled at them and said off with their head. And the head of the Metro Police in London says they were lucky not to be shot. Police chief says armed officers showed enormous restraint as mob attacked Charles and Camilla. I've seen the video. It's pretty ninnying. It's people slapping on the windows and, 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 and Camilla Parker Bowles, uh, the uh, Duchess of Detritus or wh whatever her name is, the Duchess of Filth, the Duchess of Garbage. You know, people say that these criminals don't run anything. Two years ago in Canada, the, the Queen used the Governor General to shut down the Parliament because they didn't do what she wanted. Happened in 79, uh, in the late 70s in Australia. I mean, this is a criminal organization. So the, the uh, mob boss's son with uh, his hag uh, are all dressed up in, in their strumpet outfits. Uh, and the Duchess of uh, Detritus and the uh, Prince of Puke uh, were uh, just, I mean, I mean, the video's online. We've got it linked up on Infowars.com and PrisonPlanet.com. They're literally like, oh, good Lord, as a rebel, put more fluoride in their water immediately. Brain damage them. Their IQs aren't dropping enough or fast enough. They're not submitting to us. More surveillance cameras, more armed troops, more police state immediately. This is in your house. I mean, look at how it's a frightening, a frightening prospect, a, a horrifying, the rally, they're saying off with their heads. No, I mean, that's what they're doing. And the victim is like, oh, the, the, the roaches are scurrying about. Uh, Prince Philip has tried to eliminate them. And we've overrun the nation with brooding foreigners. We can use it to put it into the police force and the CPS to kidnap their children. But these, these filthy Brits who don't like our German royal family uh, that runs everything, the Saxe Coburg Guthers, and we will deal with them. Oh. I mean, literally, Charles looked even more effeminate than his wife, just going, oh, protect me, royal God. But, uh, excuse me, I'm sorry. You can tell they all, both of them almost did a Queen Elizabeth II in their pants. You know, I, I don't usually do potty humor, but uh, around the office, uh, you know, when somebody's got to get out of a meeting or something, they're like, I'm sorry, it'll just be a Rockefeller. Uh, you know, that means a quick, you know, minute or two. But sometimes they go, hey, I got to do a Queen Elizabeth, the second, number two. And uh, all right, folks, I apologize to our radio station. It's a very family-friendly, clean show. But when I started imitating the royals, I... Uh, the rabble feel for the moment. Look at them running around like vermin in the streets. Uh, I can't wait for our world government extermination forces in place to remove as many of them as possible. Oh, I love sucking off of them, but goodness, I like to go out to the theater dressed up like an effeminate peacock with all of my medals festooning my breast with my haglet wearing a giant crown on her head. But to actually see them turn against me, I guess all those PR shows we finance telling them how weak and pathetic we are aren't working. They actually know that we're the ones sucking everything out of them. I just lectured them last month that they shouldn't take a hot bath, but I have royal trains and 77 aircraft and 94 palaces. Oh, but they shouldn't be able to take a hot bath. And I'm so pleased that the old ladies have to ride in the buses to stay warm now because they can't pay for their gas allowance. But you know, we're heating all of our palaces quite nicely. And after we've exterminated all of you, we're going to have plenty.